ओके फ्रेंड्स सो लेट अस स्टार्ट टुडे आई हैव कम विद सम प्रॉब्लम्स ऑफ ट्रिगोनोमेट्री एज आई टोल्ड यू दैट माय नेम इज संजय सिंह एंड आई एम फ्रॉम दिस संजानवी कोचिंग सेंटर सैलम तमिलनाडु ओके सो फॉर द बेनिफिट ऑफ स्टूडेंट्स हु आर स्टडिंग ट्रिगोनोमेट्री एंड हु आर इन इलेवेंथ स्टैंडर्ड वेदर इट इज मेट्रिकुलेशन स्टैंडर्ड और सी बी एस ई फॉर ऑल ऑफ देम इट इज वेरी यूजफुल यू नो दैट ट्रिगोनोमेट्री इज अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट चैप्टर एंड इट इज प्लेइंग अ मेजर रोल इन आवर डे टू डे लाइफ ओके सो आवर कंसेप्ट हैज टू बी वेरी स्ट्रॉन्ग इन दिस ट्रिगोनोमेट्री ओके सो लेट अस स्टार्ट Uh, solving this type of question because uh, 100% in examination this type of question will be asked to you huh? okay so let us start so one question is given to you here that if a cos theta minus b sin theta is equal to c we need to prove that a sin theta plus b cos theta is equal to plus minus a is whole root a square plus b square and minus c square okay so let us uh, solve it so how we will be solving so let us go for solution of this one right so what we are given we are given that a cos theta minus b sin theta is equal to c correct okay so now let us see that how we are reaching uh, to our target what uh, target is given to us the target is given to us as a sin theta plus b cos theta and we need to prove that it is equal to plus minus whole root a square plus b square minus c square right okay so what we will be going for we will be going for squaring both side first so we will go for squaring both sides so after squaring what we find uh, we will be going for so a cos theta minus b sin theta whole square is equal to c square now see if you are going for square so we will be using the same formula what formula is there so the formula is a minus b whole square algebraic formula so a square minus 2ab plus b square okay so this formula we have used a square minus 2ab plus b square correct now we will be applying the same formula here so if it is so we will be writing uh, a cos a square cos square theta minus b square sorry not minus b square sin square theta and minus 2ab cos theta sin theta so it is equal to what c square correct right now what we will be doing so we already know the formula that is cos square theta plus sin square theta and it is equal to 1 right so from that we can substitute the values and if we are substituting the values uh, what we are getting so a square we will write for cos square theta that is 1 minus sin square theta and for uh, b square sin square theta we will be writing 1 minus cos square theta okay right and then minus 2ab sin theta cos theta is as it is and it is equal to what c square correct right very nice so now uh, we will see that how it is solved further so we are getting what we are getting a square okay and minus a square sin square theta similarly plus b square and minus b square cos square theta minus 2ab sin theta cos theta is equal to c square correct okay so now what you do you bring this c square this side so 
it will be equal to a square plus b square this one we will write this one we will write and we will bring this c square this side so minus c square ok another side we are taking what a square sin square theta and plus c square cos square theta and 2 a b sin theta cos theta so if you are observing clearly now so this particular part which is in RHS now so what it is so we can write like this so that will become what so it is becoming right hand side that is a sin theta plus b cos theta and square so it is a plus b whole square which is equal to a square plus b square minus c square right so further what we get further what we are getting we are getting that a sin theta plus b cos theta is equal to what so here it will be plus minus whole root a square plus b square minus c square and that only we have to get so this is the solution huh? so we have this got it so this solution already you have seen uh, you know, from the top you can have a glance that how we have solved we have gone for squaring a cos theta minus b sin theta b squared and then we further moved in this position and then uh, we applied a minus b whole square and further we have substituted that identity sin square theta plus cos square theta is equal to 1 that identity after uh, putting it uh, we got uh, the equation in which easily we could get our solution in our last step ok right ok right. I will come with uh, uh, another video uh, in next and again we will be solving some of the uh, questions and then you will find that how easy it will be ok right so let us go for another question in this one ok right so another question is that same I am showing it to you uh, have a glance that another question what it says it says that if sin theta and plus cos theta is equal to m ok so we need to show that cos to the power 6 theta and plus sin to the power 6 theta is equal to 4 minus 3 m square minus 1 whole square by 4 ok so this question also will be solved in that same manner Hmm? So, we will be solving in that same manner, just have a glance. So, uh, we will start from our solution side only. Okay, solution. So, what it is? So, as we all are knowing that here cos to the power 6 theta plus sin to the power 6 6 theta, we have to solve it. Right. So, let us see. So, cos to the power 6 theta plus sin to the power 6 theta we can very well write it in the form as cos to the power you can say 2 and theta cos square theta plus sin square theta and we will be making it as cube cube so now it has taken the form as a cube plus b and a cube b plus b cube is the identity now which is a plus b into a square minus a b plus b square correct so this a square minus a b plus b square formula we will be using it so now let us use it ok so equal to so what we will be getting now cube we have to do it so cos square theta and plus sin square theta so this one we have assumed as a and this one we have assumed as b so a plus b ok and further so a square so cos square theta correct so we will be writing like this 
whole square plus sorry minus AB so AB cos square theta sin square theta okay plus B square so sin square theta whole square we have written like this okay very good so now see how we are solving so cos square theta plus sin square theta already we have seen that this identity is equal to 1 so 1 and inside what we are getting we are getting cos to the power 4 theta yes or no okay minus okay this one also will write here no problem so sin to the power 4 theta minus cos square theta sin square theta right okay. Uh, so cos to the power 4 theta plus sin to the power 4 theta now it has to be resolved correct so this one we will be solving further so for this one what we are writing so suppose if we are taking cos square theta plus sin square theta whole square okay if we are making it then we are, we are getting we are getting cos to the power 4 theta okay right and plus sin to the power 4 theta and minus not sorry minus so it is plus twice cos square theta sin square theta correct so from here what we are finding we are finding that this cos 4 theta plus sin to the power 4 theta we can write it as cos square theta plus sin square theta whole square minus 2 cos square theta sin square theta yes or no okay so what this is cos square theta plus sin square theta whole square so that is 1 only so we can write 1 minus twice cos square theta sin square theta correct okay so we can replace that and uh, cos for this cos to the power 4 theta plus sin to the power 4 theta we can very well write this one and we can write 1 minus twice cos square theta and then sin square theta and further minus cos square theta and sin square theta so what we got we got 1 minus 3 cos square theta sin square theta now further uh, we need to observe some more okay here some more we have need to observe so what we see again we need to substitute so what we are given we are given that sin theta plus cos theta is equal to m that is given to us now let us go for squaring squaring again both sides uh, so what we are getting we are getting sin square theta plus cos square theta and plus twice sin theta cos theta is equal to m square again this one will become 1 so what we are getting we are getting twice sin theta cos theta is equal to m square minus 1 right for this we can substitute 1 very good so further sin theta cos theta is equal to what so m square minus 1 by 2 ok so now you see this one we can write as so we will go for squaring again because we need to put there sin square theta cos square theta so if we are squaring sin square theta cos square theta so what we are getting we are getting m square minus 1 whole square correct whole square by so we are getting as 4 right so this sin square theta minus cos sin square theta cos square theta we can replace m square minus 1 whole square by 4 so here again we will be replacing it so here 1 minus 3 m square minus 1 whole square by 4 okay right sorry uh, this one is uh, not here this one is here and this minus 
3m square minus 1 whole square. So from this we can get 4 minus 3m square minus 1 whole square by total 4. That only we need to solve. Okay. So we need to solve this one only. Correct. So have a glance once again. So how it is solved. So step by step if we are solving and we are using identities simultaneously. Okay, so there are so many identities we have to use algebraic identities including trigonometric identities like sin square theta plus cos square theta is equal to 1. You have already seen that how we have uh, done and how we have used all those identities and after that we are able to show it. So this we can say that we have proved as we have got. Okay, gentlemen. So very good and uh, we will be coming back with some more videos. Uh, please do like my channel and uh, subscribe for it. And uh, please give comment. Okay. So I request your comment uh, so that uh, it will be good to improve more and more and uh, I will also come to know that whether I have reached you or not, whether it is it has become useful or not and with your comment only which will be encouraging me more and more. So I will be uh, going for it. Huh? So more and more videos I will be preparing on this trigonometry and uh, other uh, mathematical subjects also. Okay. Very good. Thank you.